hi everyone we want to find the value of a from this given exponential equation we have 8 raised to power a plus 2 raised to power a is equal to 130 solution we have the given equation 8 raised to power a plus 2 raised to power a is equal to 130 then 8 raised to power a can be expressed as 2 raised to power 3 raised to power a plus 2 raised to power a is equal to 130. Remember, if you have s raised to power n raised to power of m is the same thing as s raised to power n m, which is equal to what? s raised to power m raised to power of n then this one become 2 raised to power a raised to power 3 plus 2 raised to power a is equal to 130. Now from here, what do we do? We have 2 raised to power a cube, then plus 2 raised to power a is equal to 130. Then we have 2 raised to the power a cube plus 2 raised to the power a then if this plus 130 cross equal side become minus 130 is equal to 0 we've equated to 0 that is 2 raised to the power a cube plus 2 raised to the power a then if this plus 130 crosses equal side become minus 130 then equal to 0. Let 2 raised to the power a is equal to t. There we have t q plus t minus 130 equal to 0. Now let's see. 130 is the same thing as 130 is equal to 26 times 5 then we work on 26 then we we'll look for and the coefficient of t here is what 1 then we can write this 26 as minus 25 t plus 26 t then you are going to get t we're going to get this t back now let's replace t by this value we have t cube minus 25t plus 26t minus 130 is equal to zero this does not formally change the equation because minus 25t plus 26t is going to give you the same t now let's factorize we have t into t square minus 25 plus 26 into t minus 5 equal to 0 then we have t into t square minus 25 plus 26 into t minus 5 equal to 0 then we have t into t square minus 5 square plus 26 into t minus 5 equal to 0. Now, this is different of 2 square. If you have a square minus b square, it's same thing as a plus b multiplied by a minus b. Then our equation becomes t into t plus 5 multiplied by t minus 5 plus 26 into t minus 5 equal to 0. Now here we have t minus 5 and here we have t minus 5. We have t minus 5 then into 
here is t into what t plus 5 plus 26 equal to 0 then we have t minus 5 into t times t we have t square plus t times 5 5 t then plus 26 equal to 0 now t minus 5 equal to 0 or t square plus 5t plus 26 is equal to 0. Now from here we have t minus 5 equal to 0 therefore t is equal to what? 5. That is one of the value of t. Now from here this is a quadratic equation we have t square plus 5t plus 26 is equal to 0. Let's solve using quadratic general formula. We know that s is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Therefore, our t is same thing as minus b plus or minus square root of what b square minus 4ac divided by 2a and from this equation a is equal to 1 b is equal to what 5 and c is equal to 26 then let's substitute we have t is equal to minus 5 plus or minus square root of 5 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 26 divided by 2 multiplied by 1 then remember our discriminants is b square minus 4ac then which is equal to what 5 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 26 then 5 square is what 25 minus 4 times 1 is 4 times 26 104 then our discriminant is equal to what minus 79 which is less than 0 then we reject this the only true value of t is the only true value of t is t equal to what 5 now remember that we said 2 raised to power a is equal to what t and t is equal to 5 we have 2 raised to power a is equal to what 5 let's take the log of both sides we have log 2 raised to power a is equal to log 5 now we have a log 2 is equal to log 5 now let's divide both sides by log 2 we have a log 2 divided by log 2 is equal to log 5 divided by log 2. Then this one will cancel this. Our final answer is A is equal to log 5 divided by log 2. That is our final answer. If